hello everyone today i am going to answer one of your query which is about how to get the volume of a model or mass using instance parameter but before we start let me remind you to like and share my videos leave a comment below and subscribe to my channel also if you have any kind of difficulty or query related to revit you can ask me anytime so now let's start open a new architectural template file then go to massing and size, click on in place mass, ok. First of all, I am going to draw a sphere, for that draw a circle, then click on create form and then click on this sphere shape. This is a full sphere but I want to create it in a dome shape so I am going to place it, give it an angle of 180 degrees. Now finish mass and when you click on this object you will see in the properties dialog box that it has a feature of cross surface area and cross volume and if you want to know them what would be the area of on level 1 or level 2 of this mass you can also get that but you can also uh, add the formula in it so for that enter um, assign a parameter of radius to this uh, sphere then open this dialog box and create a new parameter with the name volume of sphere make it instance check volume from here and it will go under the category of analysis results now enter the formula of sphere which is 4 divided by 3 into pi in revit you write pi as pi and then both of the brackets then into uh, the radius as this is a, a radius exponent 3 which is radius raised to the power of 3 now as this is a the formula for a full sphere and but we are using a half sphere with 180 degree angle so i'm going to divide this formula by 2 and now we get the volume of the sphere in this same manner if you know the area uh, area for uh, the formula of area for the circle you can enter that under this uh, 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 area parameter and enter that formula in here which is pi into r raised to the power 2 r being the radius in here in this same manner you can enter the formula for the uh, perimeter of the circle So create a new parameter and a formula which is 2 pi r. Now if you change the value of radius all of the uh, other parameters will automatically change its values. You can also adjust the radius or the mm, design of the sphere by, by adding the volume or area, by adding the values in the volume or area for this dome like shape. Now by repeating this same process, 
you can uh, get the volume the area the parameter of this rectangle by adding by creating new uh, parameters and then assigning the formulas to them as shown in this video but in the case of rectangle you cannot assign the value to the parameter of the volume or the area because in the in this case the formula has two values uh, the, the uh, two parameters concerned which is the length and the width and if you assign change the value of parameter it will not know what to give the value of length or width so in that in this case you cannot assign values in perimeter or volume or area similar Now in this mass we have created these two shades. So now in this cross surface area and the cross volume we get the, com uh, the combined volume of both the sphere and the circle and the rectangle and in the area we get the, uh, uh, the, uh, the combined area of this sphere and this rectangle and in the in the uh, in the parameter dialog box we get the individual results now in this part of the video i will show you guys about how to create how to obtain the value of, of a volume or area of a of an irregular shape irregular 3d shape for that create any type of irregular shape or in the 3d as shown in the video Now I don't know any type of formula which I can assign to this type of shape. 
so for that finish this mess then click on this uh, object and here you can always get the surface area and the volume of this type of shape which can be altered by adjust by whenever you change this shape so that's all for today i hope you like this tutorial if you have any kind of difficulty or query related to revit you can ask me anytime i will meet you guys in the next video till then goodbye and take care and most importantly don't forget to like share and subscribe